that's on the bulk of the card and what I want to show you in this quick little video and so right darling is how I use the Andes um, Andes the shedding rake um, there are two this is the new style one with the black handle and this is the old style one they're about 15 pounds now they look like a coat king uh, they got hooked teeth, but they really don't cut the coat. They just pull the coat out. So it's a great tool to remove a lot of the dead bulk that he's got here to save my fingers for more detailed work because it's a big dog to do. So um, hopefully he'll stand up in a minute um, because he's an older boy. Um, I want to let him lay down as much as he wants to so while he's laying down we'll just take some of this off you can see how much of this dead fluff there is and we're just going to be raking like this um down the coat because that's the way the hair grows there and we'll just start removing this brown fluff which i could pull it out with fingers but that would really hurt so and there comes all the dead coat um and then we can Take some with fingers and a little bit more down his sides here. Uh, now he's not been bathed yet. Uh, we'll take some of this bark off before he'll go and have a bath because there's no need to bath all this hair that's coming out and dry it. Good boy. Um, that's a good boy. You gonna stand up for us, darling? Come on. All right, we'll do a little bit on the front here. So I'll just run gently a slicker brush through the top. I'm not gonna brush all his feathers through because he's going to be matted there. And you see a lot of this, oh, his head is heavy. Uh, there's a lot of brown here as well that we're going to take out. And good boy, there's good boy. And you see he's really, takes the bulk off this the shedding rake very quickly. Mm. I know, sweetheart. And there's all the horrible brown, you can see all the brown stuff. Because he doesn't need that. So now that he's standing for us, see we've still got a lot here and this all has to come out. So I do, and this is how we'll take that out. It's better to have less coat, but nice coat, than keeping all of this in a knot that's basically dead. Um, he's just going to look a lot better. It's no good keeping it if it's not looking very nice. We're going to make you a very handsome boy. And we want to come down here on his ribcage See that the feathers, these are growing from way too high up. His rib cage is down there. So we have to take all of this out to give him that nice deep rib, rib cage there. Um, so we'll just keep going. And of course, there's gonna be some hand stripping and using some stripping knives as well, but just to take that out. He spe speeds the work out. I've been doing this for about five, 10 minutes. Look how much hair we took out already. Yeah, the shoes. So that's how quick and easy it is using this, the shedding rake. You can remove too much with it. If you keep going over the same area too much. Um, so we don't want that. We just want to be careful. Uh, how much we take out, but I can see that he's got too much there. This all has to come out. And then all this brown um, will be gone and he's going to be a lovely looking black coated boy that he should be. There's a good boy. And it doesn't hurt, it's like brushing. Um, and it doesn't cut the coat. It just pulls all the ugly bits out really nicely. And then I've just got a little bit to do then with my 
fingers as more detailed and some stripping knives. See if I had to do everything with fingers because there's so much, I think they would be hurting a lot, wouldn't they, darling? And it also means that he doesn't have to stand too much for me since he's an older boy. Uh, and he probably does get tired. So we don't want this. We don't want that dairy, do we, darling? He's very matted on his feathers, but we'll sort that out in the bath. And we'll just take this, this out. And you can see he's starting to take a shape and get his nice ribs out. And then uh, we'll just move all the way around uh, the front. A little bit here, this is very brown. So we'll take some of this out. Good boy, I know, darling. Oh, I know, but Mama, Mama will come back for you. Mama will. See, and that's how easy it is. Uh -huh. And how much quicker we got somewhere. All right, so that's really good tool to invest in um, to help you along with stripping and getting. You'll say it's looking nice. Thanks for watching.